What's up my loves and welcome back to another tutorial. In this tutorial I'm going to show you how to convert or how to change a zombie villager into back to a normal villager. Quite a few people um, have been asking me this to do a tutorial because they're not quite sure what they need or how to make something or how to change them back. Um, they are very very difficult to get zombie villagers, well they're meant to be but at the moment because there's a bit of a glitch I think uh, the 4J probably needs a patch, you do get them quite often, zombie villagers. But I'm going to show you how to change this little fella into a villager. It does take, I think, up to between 5 to 10 minutes for him to change, but it's random, um, as far as I'm aware. For, for this tutorial, you'll need a golden apple. I'll show you how to make a golden apple if you don't already know. And also, you'll need a weakness potion, and I will show you how to make that as well. You need a crafting table, of course. Um... And a brewing stand, which to get a brewing stand you need three cobblestone and a blaze rod, which blaze rods are very hard to come by. First of all, I'm going to show you how to make the golden apple. You just need one apple and eight and eight golden ingots, because I've already got ingots on me, which is kind of stupid. And you just scroll across. Where's the apple? Actually, no, you don't need golden ingots. It's oh shit, <laughs> my was like you need. Um, not golden nuggets, you need golden ingots. Uh, let me find golden ingots. That's a bit of a F up from me. Where are the golden ingots? Golden ingots, where are you? Where are the golden ingots? Right. Right, you need golden ingots, not golden nuggets. Scroll all the way to the golden apple, and there you go. You have got yourself a golden apple to give to the zombie villager. Next is to make a weakness potion. For the weakness potion you'll need never waltz uh, which gets it ready to become a potion. You need a glass bottle and then you need to fill it up with water. So any water source you've got fill it up with water and then you need um, a fermented spider eye and I'm going to show you how to make a fermented spider eye. Now you need sp a normal spider eye, you need sugar and you need a brown mushroom mushroom to make the fermented spider eye and then I'll get the, the never wall the gunpowder makes the potion turns the potion into a splash potion right because you can't literally make him drink it so you need to splash it on him so we make the uh, fermented spider eye first so like I said you need a spider eye mushroom and sugar and that converts it into fermented spider eye then you go into the brewing stand put the bottle that you've got, you can have three bottles in there at a time, but I'm only going to do one uh, at the moment. Uh, you First of all, you put the Neverwalt in there first, and it'll tick down, and you can see the bar going on the right hand side next to where the Neverwalt is, above where the bottles are. It's going all the way down, down, down. And when that is finished, it'll be finished in a second, there you go. Next is the Fermented Spider Eye goes in, that turns into the actual weakness potion which you require to change the zombie villager back to a normal villager so when that's done and then the next one you put in there is gunpowder gunpowder changes it into a splash potion from a normal drinking potion to a splash potion which you need so you put the gunpowder in there as you can see there's it's a weakness potion you can make it stronger uh, you put glowstone in there which will make it number two weakness potion and I think it goes on for a little bit longer. I think you get a min two minutes and something rather than just one minute and thirty. And that should change it into a weakness potion. Splash one. There you go. And then you go up to the villager. First of all, you splash him with the weakness potion. And then you give him the golden apple. And then you can hear that noise. You hear the noise? He's slowly, slowly changing. This could take... <laughs> sometimes it takes five five minutes. Sometimes it takes ten minutes. It just varies a little bit, that's all. So I'm going to speed this bit up. And if you've got any more tutorials you want me to do, just leave it in the comment section below and I'll see if I can do it. And then I'll make a video for you guys. So I hope you enjoyed. If this has helped you out, guys, you didn't know how to, do the zombie, how to change a zombie villager into a villager, just give it a thumbs up. If this has helped you out, much appreciate you guys, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye! Two hours.
hours later.